similar to Taylor's background, I also was a NFL and college football coach for 12 years. And when I left coaching and started to explore the esports space and started meeting with executives and coaches for the professional teams in LA, one of the things that I kept hearing was that there was kind of this lack of overall structure and leadership um, present in kind of the professional realm as it, as it were right now. And so when I started to get into it, it was really uh, focused on helping them understand what are the work habits that, are, that it's going to take to be successful. Um, why is it important to drink water versus coke? Um, you know, if you're going to be sitting down for eight, ten hours a day. Um, even things just as simple as like understanding what it takes to be prepared for a day of work. Um, obviously, it's a little different in the professional realm than it is in college or in high school, um, but. You're being paid to play this game, and it is essentially a job. And this is not just sleep in and wake up whenever you want to, um, and basically just roll into your day. You have to be ready to attack your day and perform at your highest level, whether it's a Tuesday practice or whether it's game day. So really kind of getting them to change their mindset um, around that was something that really intrigued me as I started to get into the esports space, and that's one of the things I really enjoy working with uh, the Gladiators right now, the ability to influence the mindset and kind of just their overall behavior on a day-to-day -day basis.